Well, the technology is pretty simple. It's uh, uh, effectively trying to build the entire robot out of Lego. And really the biggest problem we ran into today was uh, the sand. Um, blowing sand doesn't do too well uh, with Lego robots. So I think we would fare better in a parking lot environment than out at the Great Sand Dunes. Do an alternate event, I guess, where we are solving the navigation task in a more uh, controlled environment to to define the beacon. Perhaps having a more controlled environment to get that task under uh, under control first, and then run it with uh, harsh terrain. What are the difficulties? This seems like it should be really easy. Don't throw anything. <laughs> Actually, we found the, the mechanical part of it was, in my eyes, was easier than the programming and the electronic stuff we had to do to get it to track the radio signal. To make the machine actually go on the sand and run in the sand, since we chose an off-the-shelf dune buggy kind of thing, I think what we've, we've learned, and we actually got this from the Adam State guys, is that this wire is probably too long and causing us some interference with our antenna. Do you see any futures in this for yourselves? I think so. I certainly hope so. Extremely interesting. It's very more, cool stuff.